I think I spilled water. Joel, how can you do that? Wait a minute, hold on. Run from the scene. I got it. I got it. For one suspect, and that search is still going on right now. Congresswoman Ayanna Pressley, she seems to hear something. Hey, Andy Custer. Uh, she. Uh, She's your congresswoman. Yeah, she uh, came out yesterday, and Pete Buttigieg. She uh, endorsed. Who? Andy Custer. You endorsed who? Peter Buttigieg. He doesn't have a chance. Well, that's what she came up with. See, the the uh, Alex Cora and the and the uh, Houston scandal. Well, that's part two. Yeah. There's never a frown when the black label's going down. You know, I tell you about, you know, is this the, uh, I mean, you know, I want to talk about Veritas. Okay, hold on. Okay, I'll tell you. Okay. What's that, hon? Uh, 201 try. I want you to say hello to Elizabeth Roth. Oh, hi, Elizabeth. Oh, oh okay. Okay. Hi, Elizabeth. How are you? Joe Moose Elber here, and uh, John Hopwood's uh, at my home in Concord tonight. Okay, wrap it up. And uh, I'll just wrap and, it up. And uh, I'm just saying hi, and, and I hope things are going well for you. Okay, uh, what, were, what did you want to bitch about next? Okay, I want to get back to it. <laughs> you know, is, to who? Is, to what? The, is the camera on? Why? Is, is the camera on? Yes, it's been on. For Why in the world would the, Red, would, would the Red Sox consider Jason Veritek? Okay. Because now, he was the captain of uh, some very successful He was, teams. you know, I don't care if he was the captain of the Army or the Navy or of the... <laughs> of the Air Force, but I'm going to tell you, if I'm going to, if he was a captain of the Navy, he'd be much higher rank than and, a captain of the Air Force. And, the Army. And, and, and for people that really don't know Jason Veritag, I, I, I'm going to tell you, in the old... I'm, well, he banged Heidi. No, no, it, it was... Did, well, you met Heidi, right? I, me and Hamer did, Gary Hamer. No, it wasn't oh, Heidi God. he banged. It was it, Heidi. No, in, in, no, it was... She was a broadcaster for the Red Sox. A broad, yeah, she's right. a woman. You're right. It, it was Hazel May. He was banging, no. He yes. was banging Heidi, the he was Christian no, girl. Hazel The May. blondie, blonde, blue eyed. I have her thing in my, and Hamer has one in his garage, too. Uh, what does Gary know? Hanging. Because yeah. we knew it was her. No, no it, it, it was, uh, I'm telling you, for, I'm, I'm get, it, it was Hazel May. I'll bet you $5,000 it wasn't. And if you think about this, that's why Nesson got rid of her. That's one of the things they said, but she went to another sports team, yeah, but then she, they went, there was a big contract. Yeah, she went and, to, uh, I think she ended up on, basketball e team. on ESPN, I think, or one of those, uh, uh, sports uh, network. That's why they uh, that they got rid of uh, her because of him. Of why would they get thing. rid of her? A good, clean living, blonde hair, blue eyed, beauteous uh, Christian girl who no. I Gary took a picture of me swooning over okay. at the uh, Fisher Cats Park and mentioned we have. Why would they get rid of her just because she's banging Jason Veritek who's married at the Okay, time? I, I, I know you're talking about Heidi. I forget her last name. Heidi Klum? No, that's no. the model. But wasn't, uh, wasn't she related? Oh, no. Her, Hold on. No. Okay. Her brother is a professional golfer. Okay. And, and I think they're brother and sister, if, if I'm not mistaken. Who? But Jason Veritek and Heidi? No, no, Heidi and uh, her brother. Her brother. <laughs> Heidi and her brother are definitely going to be sister and brother if it's Heidi and her brother. Right, but but her brother is a professional golfer on on the a golfer. Court. No, what, a Reed golfer and, or whatever. Uh, Heidi, uh, geez, I can't. Uh, Heidi, sweet. Oh. Uh, I can't, oh my God. I can't think of her name, but 
Get, I'm getting high thinking about it right now. But why would the Red Sox hire somebody with no experience? I don't care. He's, he's they only, hired Alex Cora with no experience. But the he, Yankees man no, had no experience. Alex Cora was a bench coach. He had experience. Al, he didn't have experience managing. Veritech is only a, um, uh, what do you call those people to um, uh, help people? Uh, you know, those people. You know, in the in the organization. Smiling people now. You know, he had, smile on your you brother. Know, he, hey, Gary, who's what's the last name of Heidi? That blonde-haired, blue-eyed cutie that used to be the color girl at the uh, Red Sox, who I was swooning over at the Fisher Cats. Joel and I can't remember her name. Heidi. Um, Heidi. Yeah, Heidi, yeah. but uh, but why would they hire somebody with no experience? Why did they have the Yankees hire a coach without any experience? Well, well, who, well who had Two no years ago. Well, who was that? Who had no experience? The manager that they they and <laughs> Buckethead and and got a manager with no experience. Oh, you're talking about uh, uh, oh, uh, uh, yeah, yeah. they haven't been in the World Series since when, Joe? Two thousand nine. Hey, you still gonna have to pay the contract of uh. Jacoby Ellsbury. You're talking about Boone, right? Boone. That's yeah. A, yeah, that, Aaron that's the, Boone. yeah, that's the current manager of the Yankees. Elizabeth Rupp says hi, Joel. Oh, hi. Um, um, but, uh, you know, you know, sports, you know, the bottom line with sports, folks. The bottom line okay. with sports is okay. what? It, okay, it's, it's, like, it's like you, John, or me, or Shirley owning a business, okay? It's a business, okay? And it's that, a business. And, and that's what it's all about. The, it, are you saying that the, the Jets are a business and they're not a religious? No, uh, every sport, basketball, football, hockey, soccer, it's a business. You can't? It's Joel is talking about the New York Jets. Hi, Elizabeth. I can't call you back. Well, yeah, because we need to know the name of the color girl, uh, Heidi, the blonde-haired, blue-eyed Red Sox color girl that uh, Jason Veritek had an affair with. Do you do you remember that? Uh, I have I, I, I have no idea what you're talking about. All right, call us back when uh, you know we're talking about uh, Jason Veritek uh, become, becoming the new manager of the Red Sox. Heidi, a quick question. It's not Heidi. It's Elizabeth Rob. Oh, 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 it's a, <laughs> it's a, I, I'm sorry, Elizabeth. I was telling, uh, I, I was telling John. It was I don't know uh, maybe you you maybe you. You're, She's you're, a great sports fan. Well, maybe you're uh, uh, too young, but in 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 a couple of, uh, maybe about ten fifteen, I said to John it was Hazel May. This was not fifteen oh. years ago. It was one the time I was in Manchester. It was Hazel. It was like six or seven years what ago. What does Manchester have to do with it? I'm talking about. Uh, because I met her. She's an angel, I'm, Heidi. I, listen to me, Elizabeth. It, it was it was Hazel May. It wasn't. Uh, no, it wasn't. It, it wasn't Paula or a Schmo or. What does him having a, an affair with, with another woman make? That disqualifies him from being a baseball manager. Because the Red Sox organization got got hold of it and they fired her. All right, ask That's Elizabeth why. what she has. She has to leave. Okay, okay. you got to leave, with Elizabeth. What do you have to say? Okay, bye. Call us, we'll be. Okay, bye. Okay, so. Uh, you even, you pissed off Elizabeth Roth no, with your. No, no, she pissed, didn't know the answer. You pissed off so full of. She didn't know the answer. It was She's Heidi busy. he was having the affair with, not Hazel May. It, it was Hazel oh, May. Oh, you're trying to make no, up the Jason Hazel that, that the Red no. Sox are racist, no. and that's not true. Go on, go on Google and ask, and ask. Hazel May is a person, a woman of color. No, find out who, who hated. I won't. Oh, where's my phone? I'm Tanya. Have well, a sip of scotch. I'll look it up while you bet. I'm, I'm Tanya. It was. We were talking. Why, why would they fire Alex Corey? He got 108 victories, you know. And then they, the Major League Baseball office cracked down on cheating. And then they went to the well, this year. What? Do you think that had something to do with it? Oh, absolutely. I mean. Oh, you're full of. Because they're telling you right here on TV, he was the mastermind when he was with Houston Astros. He was not the mascot yeah, of the yeah. Houston Astros. No, he wasn't the mascot. He was the mastermind. Who is the mascot of the Houston Astros? Uh, is he a little guy with like six shooters? I think it was Pedro Martinez. No, uh, he's the Red Sox. You know, Greatest pitcher of but, the generation. But you know what? I, I'm going to tell you about Pedro. Pedro. You know, you know, you know, and... 
He's he's a Yankee guy. Oh, he's never. I'm, I'm telling you something. He's I, in the Red Sox. On the Red Sox. The Red Sox, Sox almost he's tied. Wearing a hat. The Red Sox. The Yankees almost hired him as the pitching coach. Boy, he's no, a no, Red Sox. No, he's, he's got a cap on in the uh, Hall of Fame. Hey, anybody can put it. You can put it. You can put a Red Sox. You can wear a Red Sox cap. You can put a Yankee cap on. You can put a Houston Nash. He, he, he didn't go to the Yankees, did he? Huh? He's he's part of the front office at the Red Sox. I'm telling you, and, and he he wants to be in the Yankee organization at some point. Oh, that's bullshit. Oh, bullshit. It's a fact. He it's out there. He was a Yankee briefly. Uh, ah, yeah, yeah, Yankee briefly. So you agree with me? His greatest years were with what teams? Montreal and the Red Sox. He had a year with the Red Sox. That they say he's even better than than. Uh, the uh, the greatest Jewish athlete said Samson Sandy Colfax's 65 season when he won 27 games, and Mr. Baseball said Sandy was the best pitcher he ever saw. You know he never pitched on Sabbath. It was right? Heidi yes, Watney. Watney, yes. Gary Hamer. Yeah. Oh, okay, Watney. That's right. Very good, uh, Gary. Very she, good, Gary. How she. she Party. Jason Verity. No, right? it wasn't her. It was it was Hazel S. Gary. It asked Gary, it was Hazel May. Okay, it wasn't it wasn't Wally. No. You don't know You know both You're not a Red Sox fan. You know, it's been publicized on, 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 on magazines, on talk radio show, on TV. Joe, what, what kind of memory do you have? Joe, how many votes did you win by uh, when you beat uh, that old fart in Ward 12? Oh, Puss Nuts there, Marston, Dick Marston, by what, 7 6? Joyce Craig said, I'm sorry, say you three well, votes Joyce in, in one hour because that Tammy yeah, Simmons was. That's right. I, that's right. Joyce was the best back. To her. She still is the best mayor. Yet uh, you accused her of turning against you. Yeah. Her and Mike. No, you did it. I'm just saying, I'm just saying that. Joyce and Mike are the best of the best she in said my book. You never turn on you, remember? You know, Mike, you know, and Joyce, I love you guys. But I'm telling you. It, it wasn't Hazel May. It was Hazel May. They, they slowly, secretly ran her out of town. They didn't t run Hazel May out. They Hazel did. May got a big job on ESPN. Heidi went didn't go to ESPN. She went to another team. It wasn't Heidi. She went to Los Angeles. It wasn't Heidi Watley that he had an affair with. It was... It was, it was Heidi Watley. And she was a nice... Get Gary on the phone. Girl. Get Gary Hammond on the phone. He's an important executive. He's not going to talk to us. <laughs> what do you mean he's, a, he's, he, what do you mean he's an executive corporate... But he, he, he's one of us. He is an, he's an executive director of a big insurance firm. Just because he came and drank with us a few times doesn't mean he's our level of... <laughs> well, I like Gary. Get him on the phone. I'll talk to him. He won't answer you. Yeah, he will. Well, I'll, I'll give you, but you know, you'll have to answer. He, he, you'll just get his uh, answer in. Beat your phone. It was Heidi Watney. Heidi Watney was no, lovely. No, no. I, you know what? I'm going to edit this up. <laughs> right? That's high. Well, well, For me, that's the highest well, well, praise. Well, that's what you enjoy. Hey, I'll drink it. Hazel hey, May was okay. a good uh, looking yeah, dough. You know. Hazel May went to East Penn. Heidi went to an LA team. And then the Red Sox <laughs> with her contract. And she, she had to take a year off. Yo, Gary. Let's say who you are. Gary, it's Moose. I'm here with John and we're debating. Did, did Heidi... Watley have Watney. A, Watney have an affair with uh, Jason Veritek and I said no, it was Hazel May. Well you're the one who brought up the affair because you're bitching about Veritek becoming the man So since you're you know pretty knowledgeable on baseball, we just want to know to get your your your, your oh, input. A ask Gary if he wants to bet a hundred bucks and five to one odds that the Super Bowl champs of twenty twenty one will be the Jets. You know the same bet you gave me. Uh, Gary, okay. Uh, hundred to hundred bucks, five to one. The Jets are the Super Bowl okay, champion. Okay, proposition. If you want to get into this action, you have to of course, put up. Nobody could take this bet. It'd be fast. You, you got to put up a hundred dollars. We give you five to no, one. No, no, I'm not. You are. I'll give you. I'll give you five to one odds on a hundred dollar <laughs> bet 
that that the Jets with win the 2020 2020 2021 you, he already Super said Gary that he's gonna win the 2020 World uh, Super hey, Bowl hey hey we gotta get together you know Heidi okay you know, that's enough you know and everybody else you know okay fall. okay good night okay I think the nobody's gonna that nobody can take that bet it's it'd be stealing money. Uh, it's like stealing candy from a baby. I'd be, I'd be, I'd be lucky. I, I, you know, I, I wouldn't even. Okay, I'll call. You, I wouldn't even. I wouldn't even hesitate to take him. I'm gonna call the morning show tomorrow because Mike Doyle will be on, and I'm gonna how call you me. Know? Is Mike me, is on tomorrow? Well, he's always on Friday. He's always on Friday. No, no, that's not, not, that not necessarily. Joel gave me and Gary Hammer hundred dollar bets, five to one odds that the Jets would win the World Series. How can they possibly win the World Series? Because. Because they won. What are you, a terrorist? They're gonna blow every other team up. Think about it. <laughs> Seven victories. The second the Super Bowl. half of the season, they won six games. What does that oh. tell you? Okay, they're moving on to next so year. So if they win twelve games, that's a guarantee of winning the Super Bowl. The freaking guess what? The Patriots went sixteen and nothing and won three. Uh, what was it? Two or three playoff games? Did they win the Super Bowl that year? No. No. And I was out on the West Coast, and it was the only time in my lifetime that a football game, there was no odds given. It was a straight bet. Right. I don't know if that was the East Coast. Yeah, but... I'm Christ, not... in that last 50 minutes, <laughs> people were still thinking that Brady could pull it off. Right. Let's you make... hate the... Ger you, let's, let's... you hate the Giants, because they are the class team of New York, and the Jets are just a friggin' doormat. They're less than the Mets. They, you know, if the Jets, the Jets are like one of those toilets in Turkey, which is the hole in the wall, and you just well, how do you put your feet that? on the other side of the cement blocks and in the hole. They're, That's the Jets. They're, they're a in the hole. They're a professional team. How can and you say that? All the the hole. Hole. This friggin' water comes and gets your ankles wet. They are in the hole in the Turkish toilet. No, you know. the Giants? No, no, no. How, many, how many Super Bowls have the Giants won? It doesn't matter how many, how many Super, Super Bowls it have Bill Belichick. How many Super Bowls, Bowls or how many rings they get? Bill okay. Ch Belichick has eight rings. Yeah, eight rings. So, two with the Giants. Two with the Giants.